the main event of the evening. The fighters are in their corners and they are ready. Let's get ready to rumble! Andy Ruiz! Wearing white with black, Joshua! Anthony Joshua grabbing right, a swig of water and now we'll hear the instructions from referee Michael Griffin. Obey my commands, I want you to protect yourselves at all times. Andy Ruiz Jr. getting his second chance, have one in 2016, lost the majority decision to Joseph Parker. First one! Round one underway. Joshua, a significant perception thanks to his doughy body. This ended up actually being maybe even a tougher opponent. The only time he went the distance was against Joseph Parker, which he said he didn't park because everybody was way fewer punches per round than he did earlier in his career. Maybe patient is the better word as Ruiz caught him with the right hand after Joshua missed over the top. Ruiz said to win a fight like this, you have to be willing to die in the ring, and that's the mentality he'll have. Use your height in the ring. You can't get past the jab if you jab up and down. Shoot one there, but you have to faint first. Don't fall in and don't rush anything, okay? Have a little drink. Start of round number two. Interesting, I thought that was an actual conversation. It's in round number two with a nice combination up top and a good exchange from Joshua and already more action. Joshua fighting in the United States for the first time, fighting outside the UK for the first time of his career. Even though he is aware of the vulnerabilities that could pose if he does. The right hand that time from Joshua caught Ruiz. And then a left hand from Joshua, but a nice counter from Ruiz up top. Once again, just a very measured round, I thought. I don't believe Ruiz can let too many rounds just slip by. From that last round. Good left hook that time. Started out like a jab, and he just turned it. Fuck! Start of round number three. In between being in camp and getting right back in after he got this fight. And there he goes down! After getting dropped by Joshua. And, and Ruiz counters. counters! Ruiz counters and Joshua is down! What a third round here at Madison Square Garden! Changing its tune a little bit here. Right. Come on, really right. liking Come on. what Ruiz is doing. Can Ruiz take advantage? Big right hand there from Joshua. Right, right. Come on. Joshua's in trouble. Joshua's in big trouble. He doesn't have his foot in. Three. Absolutely right. And still time, 30 seconds in this round. Diving with a big right hand that lands on Joshua. Headed towards the end of the round, and Joshua's down again! You can get up in time to get to him. Here, look at him, look at him. He is in big trouble. Anthony Joshua had incredible trouble going to his corner. All right, we're going to get another look. You saw a right hand from Joshua. And then that left hand behind. And that always affects the equilibrium of a fighter. Three more shots, four more shots, one but Start of round number four, and Ruiz right away on the attack. Ruiz recovered beautifully from the knockdown that Joshua dealt him at the beginning of round number three. Joshua had been down just once before in his career. Big left hand there from Joshua. Ruiz. Ruiz stalking Joshua, who would love to keep him at distance with that jab, and now Ruiz is saying, let's go. Ruiz. Uh, an inactive round from both fighters thus far after. Solid jabbing and right hands, moving, defending with your head, moving. Back it out, let's go! You to get your composure back, Anthony Joshua right, asking no what no shot no was. And this is usually a world-class athlete. You can feel it in his feet. For him on, this is much more of a fight than anyone expected with Ruiz. And Joshua now just pawing with that jab, not throwing it with any intent at all. Joshua... Still waiting for him to show his power. Did with a counter right. 
Ruiz dives with the left, sizing up Ruiz after the incredible activity of the third round. Both fighters have... Joshua Big left hook there, doubles up, and now on the attack of Ruiz. Joshua oh, lands a right hand. Ruiz now trying to whip through the mitts of Joshua. Time. That does it for round number five. Exactamente. Jab, jab, right hand. If you catch him, don't look for power, look to box. All right, so let's take a little look at this. And I think this little rally right there, the left hand. Round six underway. Nice left-handed jab from... Joshua, nice right hand. Ruiz with 38 punches landed through five rounds to Joshua's 33. Right hand by Ruiz. Andy Ruiz, both of his parents from Mexico, trying to accomplish that tonight. Ruiz twice in that third. Vladimir Klitschko, the only other boxer. Now a jab up top that catches Joshua. This and Joshua again losing his footing a little bit. So I have to say, on my scorecard, I still have Joshua winning the fight. Triple G sitting there and sitting there with Rosie Perez, one of my favorite all-time actresses. Start of round number seven. Knockdowns. Joshua big left hand that stung Ruiz, and then Ruiz right back to Joshua, and Joshua in trouble. And it seems that every time, Joshua finally landing a big blow, and now another. Can Ruiz counter? Joshua's down. He is a huge struggle now. Maybe all that's it. it. That is it. Andy Ruiz at Madison Square Garden. How do you like it? Mystifying performance from both Ruiz and Joshua. For the first time in Anthony Joshua's career, he has fallen. And a very gracious Anthony Joshua. A stunning victory for Andy Ruiz. Sent Joshua to the canvas twice at the end of round number three. Incredible seeing anyone do to Anthony Joshua what was done tonight by Andy Ruiz and against Joseph Parker, who Joshua also went 12 rounds with. Joshua. Deontay Wilder, of course, is not in the building tonight.